Um, as you probably already know by now, the GNOME terminal has been ported to add WITA widgets for the GNOME 46 release. A bit later, it also gained a tabs overview with all the extras, like the pinned tabs and everything. But it also got the newest find bar that replaces the search dialog. Basically, GNOME Terminal was transformed to Prompt Terminal, but it has one additional feature that overpowers Prompt like a boss. Can I show you, please? It's inside the preferences. One second. Um, here we are. So there is this option that we can set which window corners will be rounded. When on top only, the top window corners will be rounded, but the bottom will be square. With none, both top and bottom window corners will be squared. And on default, all corners will be rounded following Gnome Hig. When I saw that option for first time, that was basically like two hours ago, I thought they made it so Gnome Terminal could keep consistency with non-Gnome environments that aren't using rounded borders or something. But then I thought, wait a minute me, Gnome developers don't give a shit for other Linux desktops. So what's really going on here, chief? And pretty please don't get that wrong. I don't mean that Gnome devs don't care for other desktops, it's just that, um, you know, they are not even aware that other projects even exist. I was super curious, so I went to GitLab, and I found this issue that asks to add round borders. Basically, that talks about libhandy rather adwaita, but I believe it's still valid. So Christian Perch, that's the terminal and VTE maintainer in case you don't know, he is like... Making all four corners round would be bad, since for the bottom left right corner, that interferes with the content, and he brings console as example that adds wasteful padding. Um. What wasteful padding, you may ask? This wasteful padding. Six pixels on the right and six pixels on the left, and multiply these 12 pixels with, let's say, 30 rows, and you have wasted 300 pixels already. And all this space gone, just because this radius mighty slightly annoying the first and last characters that I can't actually reproduce, but to be honest, I prefer some padding anyway because it feels easier on reading. Oh! And about the matter of overlay scroll bars, not gonna happen, bro. Cause the content should take precedence over the style, boy. I'm bussin' and I know it.